Hello my friends and welcome to another Tuesday of tutorial. I am Leonardo Perez Nieto and today we will draw a woman playing with planets or stars. Let's begin sketching the top of the head. Marking the hair and then the shoulder and arm. She will be in profile. So we do the eyebrow, eyelash and nose, just barely indicated. I am drawing with a fountain pen, as you see, and with dark grey ink. The list of materials is in the description below the video. We draw her hand, the other arm, and then a circle for something that could actually be like a moon. Good, and now let's sketch her body. The upper torso and her legs. She's going to be holding it like this, like catching it or maybe swinging it. And let's add some more up here in what will be a dark sky. I want to invite you to follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Artist Leonardo to see the new projects that I'm working on as well as news on exhibits and stuff like that. Let's draw her short dress which will be like so and then we begin shading with hatching and cross hatching of course since we are drawing with ink when doing the shading lines try to follow more or less the shape of the volumes now here let's mark some stars I switch to a different fountain pen with black ink to draw the dark sky. Let's try this way to do the star. I think it will work better. Leaving some light near to it. And then the rest will be all black. If you are liking this video, please consider subscribing to Fine Art Tips. Thank you. We should draw them of different sizes, of course. Okay, very good. This will take quite a while to fill in all the sky with this pen. So let's do an edit so that you don't need to wait. Let's fast forward about five hours. Okay, okay, let's not exaggerate. It wasn't that long. Good. Let's fine tune details and I'll try to make this a little bit rounder. Also this one. As you see, the lighter parts are very white, too white. So we need to shade them. To do the work on hair and also near the stars, I went back to the pen with the dark grey ink. Let's add some craters to the surface she's standing on. And we should give some texture to these other balls as well. This one too. And I will also darken a little bit more the surface of the moon. Alright. And if you got all the way to this point, I would love to know it. Please in the comments write me the secret code MAGIC BALLS And it's ready! If you enjoyed the video, please give it a like And if you are interested in symbolism in art and how to draw with a message Click on the video on the screen And I will see you with more creations on Tuesday